collect floats and keys. Once the briefing has finished, those of you working on games will gather to find out which unit you will be working on for the day. You will then get told which number float you will be issued. Now you know which unit you are working in, you can also pick up the clipboard for your unit. You can tell which one you need by looking at the unit name on the top of the stock sheet. It is important that you listen carefully and take the correct float and not somebody else's. Each float should have a total of £300 made up entirely of £1 coins. Before you start to use the float, you must check that your float has no discrepancies or surpluses. There will be 10 £20 bags directly in your blue float bag. There will also be 5 £20 bags in a brown cloth bag within your blue float float bag. This, in total, will make your £300 float. If you have found any discrepancies or surpluses when counting the float, you must notify your supervisor immediately. They will then notify the cash office. You have £100 separate in a cloth bag purely for you to be able to keep a track of the change you have. You must use all loose £1 coins in your float before going into your 100 float bag. Once you need to start using your £100 bag, you need to let your supervisor know so they can make arrangements before you run out of change to issue. Once you have checked your float, you must empty all of the £1 coins out of the cash bags into your float bags. You must wear your float around your waist at all times. The only exception is when you're going for a break and then you must put your float into the safe in your unit and take the key with you. You can then give your cash bags to your supervisor. Once you are happy with your float, you must sign the float sheet against your number that you have been given. Here you must also declare any personal money you have in your possession and the total amount counted in your float. You must not sign your name against a float that you are not happy to accept. Should your float be found to be missing any money at the end of the day, you will be asked to explain this. You will then be handed the keys for your unit, should you need them. You must also sign these out on the sheet provided. Plaza games and dino games will be opened by your supervisor, as they are on a different key set. 